Honored guests, lend me your ears. Long as our Fevremon suffered without a true monarch to guide her and her people. Decades have passed since last His Majesty Erland sat atop the Draken throne. Long have we endured, yet it has not been for naught. At last, the bell has tolled on the age of the Consul. At last, we may celebrate the coming of our rightful ruler. The return of the Sovereign. <laughs> My word! Such an inspiring visage! Your Majesty shall have my eternal yeah, fealty! Your no Majesty, of how long I have waited this moment! Behold, before you sits the rightful inheritor of the Draken Throne, chosen by the dragon as its enemy. Behold and rejoice! Fortune has delivered us our savior at last! At last! Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. All hail the Sovereign! All hail! Let all present Pledge your allegiance to the Sovereign. Let us be united in the hope that our legions reign when they are end. Long live the Sovereign of Vermont! Long live the Sovereign! Arisen, thou who wouldst slay the dragon, if thou seekest to behold this world in its true aspect, abandon thy reason. Cast aside thine heart and thy life both. I ask thee to demonstrate thy will, for naught but thine ambition can alter the course of the rivers of fate. Which one of you was it? No need to be shy. I've just got to take down a record of your name and face. Come on, step forward. Are you the one then? Is it you? No? Hmm, it is hard to say. If the pawn I'm looking for doesn't come forward, aha, uh -huh. I thought I recognized you. I like that look in your eyes. It is queerly brazen for a pawn. 
Most of your kind have eyes blank as a cadaver's. There's aught different about you, though. Worry not, vessel. Thr come along, you feckless duck. Do your injuries pain you? This is no place for one of your ilk. You ought not anger the overseer. Time for you to get to work. You are prepared to work. Then you all begin by carrying... Cluttered. Pray leap, or oh, 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 that poses a hindrance to you. Job well done. Now the next step is to... What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to invest... What is this commotion? Perhaps we ought to investigate. Concern it! You won't see while you can. 
to all the charge against you. You cannot linger in this place forever. You have lost your memories. It is surely the work of a foul curse, but worry not. You need only believe in your own destiny, Arisa. Survive a fall from this height. Not even a pawn. Don't just stand there. Shoot it down. Keep your distance, Arisa. Worry not for me. The grind may swallow me whole, but I will not perish. There is a stone not far from here, known as a Rift Stone. Pray, seek it out. If you're truly the Arisen, then our paths will surely cross again. Oi! Are you all right? 
right. What happened here? A griffin appears one moment and falls the next. And now you stand before me. Was it you then? The one who was riding on its back? It is a wonder you survived. A company. Exactly is this jail you say you escaped from anyway? I've never heard of such a place. There's certainly north like that here in Burma. Could it be you were held in the neighboring country of Batal? Nay, no, I suppose that's unlikely. We've been estranged from Batal ever since the war. It is difficult to imagine any citizen of Burma. Fine! Goblins! Let's take up your weapon, sir! You'll be needing it! There you go. I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. To find your strength flight, buy the curative or have a bit of green one. When one of the fears comes, best guard or dodge, else you'll be sore on the morrow. Make use of the slope. It will give you an advantage against their ranks. There are oft items to be scavenged from the bodies of monsters and their ilk. If you're not... Have you beheld the dragon as yet? I've not, and I found that a blessing. All I know for sure is that it is a beast ere more fearsome than you. Oh, I know what Where are you going? I'll not force you to receive treatment, but I'd at least like a word. Welcome, Arisen. We pawns have long awaited your arrival. What is this? The pawns. They bend the knee to you so readily, but then... No. Surely you cannot be the Arisen. You seek the Riftstone, do you not? We can take you to it. Pray. Come this way. Before you stands a rift stone. Tis a gate by which we of the Pawn Legion may cross Ur into this world. Pray, summon your pawn. Simply paint with your mind's eye the loyal attendant whom you would have serve you.
Pawns are known as crosses of the rift, for we are able to connect to and traverse other realms beyond this one. When we return, it is our duty to use our experiences and the knowledge we have gained to aid you on your journey, Arisen. From this day forth, I shall serve you as your loyal pawn, and aught I learn beyond the rift will be at your disposal. Well, I'll be a pawn summoning before my very eyes. You truly are the Arisen, then. Strange. Surely there's only meant to be one Arisen. The Watchhead would know what to do, I'm sure. Though, as luck would have it, he's away. I suppose we'll save any further questions till the Watchhead returns. You're free to do as you What? You've no memories, you say? Mayhap you could make for Melv, then. It was set upon by the dragon. The Arisen is said to bear some deep connection to the dragon. Should you be Arisen, mayhap you'll rec- Hail, Arisen. Pray, ask all you wish to know. Nomads, we are oft called. However, I cannot speak as to our true name. Riftstones are gates, that by their power have we crossed into this world. Tis the name given to fates chosen, even with your memories lost to you. Very well. May fort- This ladder looks sturdy enough to climb. If you see old unto war. Hoi there. You seem well tired. Tell you what, you can stay here tonight free of charge. I'll expect my pa always used to say, I, being armed, you should stop by the inn in Mel. Well, if you get the chance. No hard feelings if you prefer it. We must rest. Though the. We're running low on everything. We've had a hard time preparing. I sent Marcus to gather what say you. Could I trouble you to run an errand for me? <laughs> You'll be paid, of course. Glad to hear it. Here, he ought to be somewhere north of and in the know, and he'll take care of the rest. It is said that the Iraq had thoughts being in the border watch. I am attentive and loyal, and prefer to remain by your side. In battle, I shall follow your lead and prioritize support. If ever you've need of an ear to listen. I see not even the Arisen could resist my charms. Please dispense with the formality. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. Fancy a gander? I find goods for sale. Always a pleasure. I do so enjoy stocking up on supplies.
I hope our coin purse isn't too much lighter. You have my support. Hail. You a soldier? We've had to start sending out new- Is that so? Lachlan. Aye. I expect- Ocado. What? Weren't harpies reported in that area? This is the first I'm hearing of it. Say, you seem stout of heart. You've my thanks. Anacardo. We must fly to the aid of those in need. I can get to the home, but it's not my duty. Freshly rested as we are, this battle ought to be in our favor. We must not let down our guard. That was well fought. There's no one standing who might say otherwise. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. Let me get that. Should you wish to pick your foes off from afar, you need look no further than an archer such as I. Right. Hmm. Without a mage among our ranks, we've no one to heal us in times of need. Battle may be trying without someone to cure our wounds, but for now we shall just have to manage. I've an inkling. This place will yield a rarity or two. Well spotted. Shall we see what we can find? So this is Melv. The scars left by the dragon's assault are plain to see. Mayhap a walk through the
pleasure doing business with you. I've a selection of wares. That's sure to please. Hope to see you again. Can you hear me, sir? Sir, stay with me. Goodness, how are you feeling? This is the second time I've watched over you like this, isn't it? You do not remember? 
Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You withstood the fire in my stead and were well and truly charred. Twas I had thought your life forfeit. I could not hear the beating of your heart. But you hung on and by some miracle arisen. I'm afraid I don't understand your meaning. Does it have aught to do with why you were taken to the castle? They said twas so that your wounds could be treated, though I... I am of the Border Watch. Someone with Arisen-like abilities came to this village, torn in tow. No you all of this. Has he come for you? We are to part so soon, then. Mayhap you will visit me again someday. Till then, take care. Everson. Ah, excellent. You must be the one. You match my soldier's description. The ruler of Vermont, currently convalescing in the capital, became arisen here in this very village. If you claim the same, then word must be borne to the capital. I dispatched a missive before coming here, though I doubt the matter can be settled without your presence. Would you be willing to accompany me to the capital? Oh, but forgive me. I scattered my soldiers in a bid to find you. I would not depart without them. We shall have to wait till they are reassembled. Come to think of it, Sir Leonard was asking after you as well. Mayhap now would be a good time to speak with him. Last up. He may benefit from pursuing the information. Oh, have you some business with the apothecary, sir? Dreadful sorry if I was in your way. Oh, no, I'm not lost or not, sir. You needn't worry yourself on my account. I'm an apothecary in training, you see. So when I heard tell of a medicine only to be found in this bit... Well, well, as luck would have it, I've not enough gold for the medicine. It will be a shame to return empty-handed after coming all this way. What? You do that? I suppose there's no harm in that. If you are Seems my luck's not as rotten as I thought. I'll wait right here for... We could make the fruit robberant ourselves, or simply purchase some at Runa's apothecary. <laughs> well met. You're the one who saved Ulrika's life, aren't you? She told me all about it. It was a very brave thing you did. I'm in your debt. Ulrika's as good as my daughter. Now tell me, are you registered with a guild? Perhaps you already know this, but registering with a guild will grant you access to specialized training. Which, well now, that won't do. You need only speak with the innkeeper to register. Go on, it will only take a moment. If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, mayhap I can advise you. Tis a vacation for those who seek to master the sword and shield. I am a fighter myself. And should there come a time when you impress me with your prowess, naturally it is a vocation. At close range, however, a bow is nary more. It is a vocation, however, the more thus a mage is unlike. It is a vocation for the thieves' favor. Their talents depend upon their finesse. Should you dedicate to try them as you like. Very well. There is no, but I shan't take up any more of your time. Moments long awaited. I knew it was only a matter of time before your skills reached a new height. What am I to do? If there is aught you wish to know of vacations, may I... Very well. There is no... But I shan't take up any... Here at the inn, I get so few customers, you see, that I can manage both roles myself. But enough about me. Did you need something? Do come again. Okay. 
So this is where you've been. Come with me to the village entrance. The watchhead's waiting for you. Shall we seek some answers? You really ought to have returned by now. Ah, you've returned. Good timing, too. I have questions for you. First and foremost, will you accompany me to the capital? My thanks. Are you ready to depart, or do you need some time to prepare? Good. Then let us be on... This will seem of little consequence, but... We've got goblins! We have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness! your prowess. Come, follow my example. Splendid. At last, our efforts have paid off. Arisen is the lawful ruler of Vermin. So it has always been. To claim the type, our kingdom sees many pretenders, and they are. me again another time. Forgive me, Arisen. I shall see to it this does not happen again. Another statue. Mayhap will yield us aught of use. 
Climbing it would grant a clearer picture of our environs. Hold here a moment. I shall bid them open the gate. Who's that you've brought with you, Watchhead, sir? An arisen, by all appearance. An arisen? Another pretender, you mean? I see the Sovereign's ascension has done little to stop such... It is uncertain. This... What? Impossible. I'm well aware of how preposterous the idea is, thank you. However, as I do not believe it my place to rule on such a matter, I will make my report to the capital. If the claim is false, we will be rewarded handsomely for our trouble. All's been arranged. Come, let us pass through the... You're welcome to take whatever you like from my pack, Master. I'd gladly see you put what I find to good use. An ox cart was meant to meet us, yet it is nowhere in sight. Or it may have befallen it. Best we press on. I'll go and open the chest. Is everyone all right? More marks of the dragon. I have a knack for gathering items and am ever on the hunt for new finds. I'll gladly try out any useful mechanisms I espy. Goblins, approach! You have no means of exploiting our enemy's weakness! for the same result with our next attack. I dare say the cart shan't be traversing this.
sleep, Magic! of victory. One cannot help but feel indomitable. We mustn't allow ourselves to become complacent. Take each trial as it comes. It will be a joy to serve one so gallant. Seems a decent spot for a campsite. Surely a rest can wait till after we've examined our surroundings. Assist. Harpies, master! It fears fire's fury! Done. I expected to pick that up, if I must. What 
What's this? We're trapped. Judged you. I had taken you for another force arisen. Good yet the valley you showed in coming to our aid has dispelled such thoughts. Give it to one of the sentinels. You're free to make your own way to the Of course, if you'd rather continue to Well now. The road's blocked. The cart can't get through like this. A powerful current ought to set this rock to crumbling, if we could summon one. Fortunate indeed. This is a rare find. We shall have to think long and hard about what to do with it. Ah, here's the cart now. Do you intend to join us? Very well. Board the ox cart and we'll... Ox carts make for relatively safer travel. Fewer monsters are to be found on the main road. And though carts travel only by the sun's light. Look there. Rotten luck! No sense letting the enemy gain the upper hand. Well, everything gets the world! Well caught, Arisen. Fight on, and victory shall be ours. They have to cause someone to have done. Seems we drove them off. You've my thanks for aiding us. Vernworth isn't far from here. Will you join us the rest of the way? All right, into the arc.
I was informed of your coming would be arisen. Captain Brandt, this individual summoned a pawn through a rift stone, though I admit I had my doubts at first. This one's not a bad sort. Saved our hides on the way here. As decreed by the great will of our world, there can only be one arisen. That arisen now resides within the palace. It follows, therefore. You must submit to questioning. If you value your life, you will not attempt to flee. I shall conduct the interrogation myself. Stand watch outside. I beg your forgiveness for my insolence, Your Majesty. If the Queen Regent had learned of your existence, I, I had no choice but to treat you as a pretender, lest my actions draw suspicion from watchful eyes. Then you have truly you. Some days past, the people rejoice. For our true yet, not. Your arrival would have robbed the Queen Regent Gisa of everything. During the time of the previous consul, she acted as a queen in her own right, ruling the palace as she saw fit. And just after the consul's passing, when twas all but certain that her son would take his father's place. Word reached the castle that the Arisen had been found. To Deesa, your majesty's very existence is naught but an obstacle to her own family's continued prosperity. The assassination of the Arisen is an impossible feat for mortal hands. Thus, Deesa chose to abduct your majesty while you recovered from your wounds, in order to rob you of your memory with a fell curse and sell you to Batal as a slave. Following that, however, with your majesty returned, I have- I shall devise some plans to further our cause. Pray. This one's cleared of all suspicion. Pray forgive me, I'm in a bit of a hurry. <laughs> Consign it! Get back here! You there! Did you see an urchin in a cap run past just now? Many thanks. I'll catch that wretch. You're a kind one, aren't you? In fact, there's aught I would ask. Aha! Oh. Apologies, but our chat will have to wait. There's a ladder here. We ought to put it to good use. ingredients to be gathered here, I'll wager. No harm in picking a few.
Hold fast, Arisen! I will be with you in but a moment! That's enough! That's enough! The day grows darker with our every step. We shall have to be all the more vigilant. We've got goblins! I suppose I'll handle this. I cannot hold your prowess. I can do no less in service to the arena. Splendid. When part, be sure to avoid the complaint. Oil. 